Hi, my name is David Burden. This is a short demo of where we are with the Midbiquitous Virtual Player for uh, Second Life. I'm standing in front of the control strip green here and I click on Start. And it goes away to the MVP player on the web, fetches the uh, started particular paramedic case and displays first of all the text. And having read the text, I can then select the options. And it gives me an option. This is a set of soft buttons. Click number one. Onto the next piece of text. And then again, onto the next options. Gradually working through my, the uh, nodes in the same way as I would do uh, with a web based player. Uh, here we've got some media available. Automatically brings that up for me after a few seconds. And then again, moves me on to the options. And it's telling us that we've uh, now arrived at the scene and we can now choose where we're going to park the ambulance. And uh, there's a photograph of the scene. Okay, this is where we now begin to move away from uh, the conventional way. Instead of using the menus, we've actually got actually out here on the roadside, if you like. We've got a couple of sensors that detect whereabouts I'm going to park the ambulance. And in this case, I'm going to touch this sensor here. And back on the screen, we'll find it's actually told me, yep, we've chosen a great place to park. Okay, really, uh, what I do now is totally up to me. Um, so in this case, I'm going to use the radio. Just touch the radio, and it asks me who I'm going to call. And I want to call the police just so they can control the scene a bit. And now I can actually go to the patient. Um, and first thing I might want to do is uh, actually check, see what the uh, patient's uh, sounding like. So uh, we'll start off by uh, checking the uh, heartbeat. And there we can hear the heartbeat. I might also want to check uh, breathing. So again, I just touch a little touch point. And I can hear the breathing. And I might then decide, uh, having seen the condition of the patient, uh, that actually what I want to do is uh, put a cervical collar on. So I can go to my inventory. And in my inventory I have a neck collar. I press that up to the ground. And if I touch the collar, it asks me to whether I want to use it or not. Uh, we don't want the users to be uh, messing around with uh, trying to exactly position equipment. So all I do is I say yes, I want to use the collar. And automatically the collar jumps into uh, the correct location on the patient. If at any point the uh, student needs to get access to uh, related course material, then we can provide a set of binders. Uh, so here, for instance, click on this binder, and it automatically opens me up onto uh, a suitable resource, which could come from uh, the web or from the internet, in this case, connecting to Wiki Surgery. And that gives you an idea about where we are at the moment with uh, the Medbiquitous uh, virtual player.